hello friends so today in this video we are going to talk about energy as a property of system so energy is basically what it is the internal energy so if you don't know the internal energy then i'll explain it a little bit okay so what is internal energy okay so suppose there is a system now uh, suppose we supply some heat to it okay and we get some work now we all know that heat is a low grade energy lower grade energy and work is a high grade energy okay now when we supply some heat then we'll get some work but uh, all the heat is not converted to work okay so some uh, short of them is uh, kept inside the system okay so which uh, remains in the system is about q minus w and this is called internal energy u so let's come back to our topic this is just a uh, little thing that i have to explain to you before going to this topic now uh, we all know that energy internal energy the property of property okay it is a state function point function okay so let us check it more study more about this so suppose there is a there is two states okay one and two and it is a pv curve so it goes from state 1 to state 2 from two different paths okay it goes from state 1 to 2 using this path and from 2 to 1 from this path now what will be the equations for this uh, suppose this one is 1 and this one is the path a this is b okay now what would be the path 1b2 one b two and one a sorry two a one for it is for going from one to two and this one for, for the returning okay so let us write the equation for path a so uh, first law for path a would be first law for path a this would be q b equal to uh, suppose e as internal energy e a plus w a okay we we cannot define uh, internal energy as a whole so it would be delta e uh, no no it would be b sorry okay it would be b for the whole path and for the path b for the path a for path a it would be q a equal to delta e a plus w a okay sorry for that again this one for path b it would be whole b and this will be whole a now b and a act as a, a complete process okay so it is a complete cycle so for that delta e would be equal to zero we know okay so uh, summation of q cycle would be equal to summation of w for whole cycle okay now write it as delta q and delta w from these terms using these now we could write it as for q whole cycle q a plus q b or q b plus q a uh, this is the path 1 to 2 and 2 to 1 returning and this one would be w a plus w b now again resembling it okay so q a minus w a is equal to q b sorry w minus q b okay it would be wb minus qb now here we can see that uh, qa minus wa from uh, here we can find out uh, it as qa minus wa is equal to delta ea okay so this would be equal to delta ea and this one would be equal to minus delta eb so we could write it as delta ea equal to minus delta eb and here we can see that it is independent of the path followed by uh, this uh, followed by in this uh, followed by the process it is dependent on the uh, states okay so it is the property of the system if we'll take another uh, some other path for returning then it would suppose it is going from this path and returning from this another path c then it will not depend on the path it will depend on just the states that it has to achieve okay so here it would be equal to delta eb is equal to minus delta ec 
okay or if there is any any other path then it would be equal to that negative of that or if you disassemble it then so here we can conclude that the uh, change in internal energy is same for any path that it is following okay now there are some properties of the internal energy and en energy internal energy energy is basically is an extensive property okay extensive property means it is dependent on math mass okay but uh, when uh, we'll talk about specific internal energy or specific energy then it would be intensive property okay intensive property and it is a point function or point uh, or state function okay state variable state uh, point function and it is a property of a system property of a system so if we we'll talk about the cyclic integral of delta e then it would be equal to zero and this is it thank you for watching if you like this video helpful then give a thumbs up do like share and comment and don't forget to you know it